All right, Miranda, before I go home, I was gonna stop off and get some. Um, what, uh, what happened? I only left the room for like a second and you fell asleep. Are you okay? Yeah, <laughs> I'm, I'm good. You know, I don't, I don't stay up late. It's kind of past my bedtime and um, I have a lot to do with Junior tonight and stuff. Yeah, I know. You're not a night owl, but um, it's 4.30. Is it? It, it, feels, it feels later than it is. I think the daylight savings stuff still has me rocked. I'm pretty sure daylight savings happen to beside the point. You have a lot to do with Junior tonight. Do you want me to help you in any way since you're so exhausted? No, of course not. He's not your responsibility. I got it. I just um, fell a little tired. That's all. I, I guess I, I need more of catnaps during the day. This new job has me um, really using my brain a lot more. You know, writing related stuff causes a lot of fatigue. A lot of fatigue. I just want to help because you are taking on a lot right now with this new job and taking care of Junior by yourself, taking him to school. It's a lot for you. Brian, I am so appreciative that you care so much. Really, it's a breath of breath. Is that your stomach? Are you hungry? Did you eat today? I, I had Subway two hours ago. I, I'm, I'm, I guess I am a little hungry. Well, I was gonna get myself food anyway. I can pick you something up if you're if you're that hungry, Miranda. I don't want you to spend your money on me. I'm not your responsibility. And I appreciate that you care so much. I said, Miranda, I don't know what's going on with you, but can you do me a favor? Yes. What's the favor? You and me can't, you're still married. So there's not much you and me can, um, you know, just let me take care of you in my own way make me feel good. I know you don't need my help. You don't need me to do all this stuff, but it gives me a sense of, uh, it just gives me something. It makes me feel good. Just let me take care of you now and then. Cause I, I care about you. Okay, I'll stop being so stubborn. Um, I, I really appreciate it, Ryan. I'm not gonna ask again, but are you sure everything's okay? Cause you can talk to me about anything really trying to work on being receptive to whatever problems you have and not being emotional about them. No. <laughs> There's nothing that I need to talk to you about right now. I'm just really hungry. All right, well, I know you like Wendy's. What would you want me? Wendy's double baconator meal large. Barbecue sauce and ketchup. Okay then. Um, Text me that, so I remember. I'll be right back. Ah, but babe, you're not, you're not taking into consideration my work schedule, you know, making me get up that early when I work that late. You know what I'm saying? No one told you to book your prenatal that early. So, and if you're gonna be rude to me about it and you're gonna be entitled about it, then you're not in your third trimester. You can just walk to the gynecologist.